What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We about to get into So Real Tea, Regina and G5, officially over. Let's get it. What is up, So Real Gang? How are we doing today? Let's get into the video. It seems like Maya may be dropping a YouTube video. She took to Instagram the other day and posted a picture of her editing a video. Oh, maybe we'll finally be getting a video soon. Make sure you guys stay tuned for that. Let's get into G5 and Regine. So for a while now, people have been speculating that Regine and G5 have stopped talking. Well, G5 took to Instagram and posted a picture of him on a yacht. Well, he wasn't even by himself. He also posted a snippet of him dancing with the young lady. And guys, oh. it did not look like Regine at all. Guys, comment down below and let us know. Oh, no, who do you think that could be? Because it wasn't Regine. Well, Regine took to Twitter this morning and she retweeted a post that said, I don't have to accept anything that doesn't sit well with me and I won't. Then she quoted, P period, and said, love this about me. But you guys go ahead and comment down below and let us know what you think. Do you yeah, Regine got plenty of time to play the field, girl. She 20, what, four, maybe five. She got time to play the field. Go have fun, sis play in all the fields you want to play in i think she's referring to g5 a lot of people are spec I, i'm sorry to cut her off again but i just feel as though the fact that like a lot of people be trying to tell women to not go out and play i'm just not an advocate of that go out and have some fun you don't have to mess up your ph in the process but go out and have some fun you know what i'm saying because how can you find out if somebody's your actual person if you ain't out you know people in you know what i'm saying so hmm. speculating that the relationship was fake and that they were only talking for season two of toya and regine now guys comment down below and let us know what you think because g5 even took to instagram and he responded to a few people in the comment section after he removed the video of him and the girl someone commented and said why delete he respond because if i expose the truth they're gonna hate it for real Tell them stop with the fake allegations, though. Someone else. Who? Who was they? Who got the fake allegations? Was commented and said, "What's going on with y'all? DM me if you don't want to say it on here. I don't like this." Someone else commented and stated, "That man living his life with his real girlfriend. Dot dot dot. What is it? You don't understand. How slow can you get? G five. Damn. You know what? I never understand when they, you know." go on these shows and do whatever it is to get on these shows. Then they come out and they mad at people for looking forward to them being with the person they was with on the show. It don't make sense. I've even liked that comment and responded back with the exclamation mark. You guys comment down below. Do you think G5 is confirming that this is his real girlfriend and him and Regine wasn't actually together and it was just for the show? I did hear back in December, G5 was dating a young lady, but they have broken up. Do you think they are back together? Or could this be someone else? Because, guys, honestly, I don't know. Like, y'all have to let me know about this. Because I felt like she kind of liked him. So I don't know if she would be pretending to be with him just for the show. But the fact that he's posting up with another young lady and someone stated that this is his real girlfriend and he's liking it, that just means there's some type of truth to it, right? Y'all comment down below. Let me know. Got to be. That's just messy as hell. What y'all think? Right after Regine tweeted on Twitter, Armand followed up with tables turn, bridges burn. We live and learn. I mean, Girl, he's such a shady lady. I mean, he ain't lying. Then he tweeted, <laughs> good morning, family. I hope everyone have a blessed day. But you guys comment down below and let us know what you think Armand was referring to when he stated that. Ain't Ray no was on too. live last night out enjoying herself with her friend Travis. That's no oh, that she almost kind of like that for her. Live. What? kind of look like brothers and sisters there's a whole lot of that i don't know all right we're gonna go to her next video girl uh-huh a few give me a uno momento what is up so real gang how, how are we, we doing, doing today it? let's get into the video so yesterday crystal took to twitter and said say i won't post my ninja right now y'all <laughs> 
post them. <laughs> then she dropped a picture of her and her new boo. Someone commented and stated, it's a ninja ninja. You done came back to the other side. Crystal responded and said, yes, I did. A stud, a never play in my face again. So oh, guys, I'm girl. guessing Crystal's done dating studs. But you guys go ahead and comment down below and let us know who do you believe Crystal and your boo may be. Let's get into Regine Carter. Oh, yeah. Yesterday, I reported that G5 dropped a picture, a video on Instagram of him and his boo. Well, guys, since then, Regine has been on Twitter liking a few tweets that stated, if the grass is greener wherever I'm at, know that. H Hello? You're rooting for me. I love you. Then she liked, one thing about me, I be effing knowing. So guys, you never know. Maybe she was aware of something the whole time. And that is nothing wrong with moving accordingly when you find out some ish. Because she even liked the post after that that stated, life is weird right now. You gotta be careful who you trust and allow around you. She even like, this is not a time to be single. So if y'all in a relationship with somebody and they might be a little annoying, but they loyal, and you know financially y'all are stable well <laughs> as stable as you're gonna get because times are stupid hard um but that and you know y'all able to speak in things like that girl make it work because i'm gonna tell you right now ain't nothing out here they going through it the single people is going through it like another post that said the grass is greener wherever i'm at know that another tweet that stated laugh out loud god really don't play about me and i love that man and then she liked another one that said they don't like you, but boy do they watch before she got off twitter she even shared a picture that said someone once told me, you never gonna forget me i just can't remember who it was <laughs> guys i'm not sure what happened or what really took place with her g5 but let me clarify on when we stated that maybe it was for the show one thing i doubt that regine will be in a relationship just for the show but speculations have been going around saying that he was on the the show but you guys will all have to stay tuned and wait for season two to drop to find that out but from the looks of it it seems like g5 went back to his ex girlfriend now from regina tweets it's seeming like she had already peeped some weird movements or figured out that this guy wasn't for her anymore you know and maybe that's why she removed herself we we do not know guys but i don't see anything wrong with people dating until they find their person and yeah, no, you'll be uh I personally don't think no one wants to stay in a situation where they don't feel like they're being valued or treated to their liking. Mm -hmm. So if she removed herself and they know. My thing is, that if you are in a situation where you are single and you do got to play the field, play it. But I will say, play it, you know, with caution because these niggas is different out here. Not just niggas. I mean, everybody is just we dealing with different species today so you know no longer are talking no more that's perfectly fine they weren't in a relationship but you guys comment down below and let us know what you think when do you guys know that someone is not for you or how many chances do you believe you should give someone in order for them to get it right let me know are you guys okay with teaching someone how to love you or do you believe you're supposed to tell them and they should be able to figure it out and when I say figuring it out, I mean, if you ask me what is my love language and you ask me the type of things that I like and how I like to be treated and I let you know, but yet you continuously do the opposite. What y'all think? Is the person not supposed to know how to adapt to the way you want to be treated? Or do you guys believe you should accommodate them and help them figure it out? But you guys... I don't think you should help nobody figure out how to love you. I do think, though, to tell a person to love you does come with notes, a sense of direction, but not doing it for them. And then you done gave them all the sauce. Like, it, I feel like if people really want to do something, they just do it. That's just how I feel. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I'm done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.